Hello guys, this is Skysoul13 here with another Fruity Loop Studios tutorial. This time I have one for you theory lovers out there. I'm going to show you guys how to change the time signature. What you need to go, what you need to do is go up to View, Project Info, this guy right here. And you get this little thing that says uh, Info, and this is all under Project, Title, Genre, Author. What this does is it writes information to the ID3 tag if you're using mp3 what you want to do is go to general and right up the top here you see time signature bar 4 beat 4 that stands for a 4 4 time if you want 2 4 time click and scroll down now you have 2 4 time if you notice on your playlist I'll drag it over the playlist changed the squares got smaller it takes up 2 beats instead of four. I'll change it back to two, four four time and you'll notice in your playlist it's back to regular. That's all you need to know for changing your time signature. Now if you know enough theory to write a song in a different time signature than usual you don't need me to explain what a time signature is and what it does and what the different ones are. But the basic ones are four four Two four, two two, and um, I believe six four. Those are the most um, most used. That's all. I'm Guysol13, and this was another Fruity Loop Studios tutorial. Tune in for another soon.